calling people with this landline. What is this? Hey, yo, welcome to the vid. I'm up, it is 8.30, and I am off to Connor's place. I'm going to sit in his house, and I mean, that's like his office, he's got the office there. And I'm going to answer the landline. Um, he's got a 1-800 number, I think, that comes, well, he used to go to his cell phone, but he switched to the landline at his house so that I can sit there and answer it. Um, he's doing travel shows today, so he's gonna be traveling around the Midwest doing I don't know, talks about the trips that they're going on, trying to get people interested. And I'm gonna be the one in the office answering phone calls, telling them what they wanna know, hopefully. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna head over there now. And this is my office for the day. Just doing some work on the laptop, calling people with this landline. What is this? Granted, it is a wireless landline, which is nice. None of that weird cord stuff. My issue with this is that it doesn't stay on my shoulder when I'm typing. It's really hard to do this. It's easier to do with a flat cell phone. Anyway, I'm just complaining now. I haven't gotten too many calls. It's been about two hours. I've gotten like three or four calls. I'm just doing other stuff. I did some mailers. I used the scale. Um, I weighed the papers and so now I know how many stamps to put on each one. What I learned for one large envelope, the first ounce is one dollar. So one dollar to mail an envelope this size. Every ounce after that it's 21 more cents. Each stamp is worth 50 cents, so two ounces for one stamp. So as long as it doesn't go above, what was it, three ounces, then three stamps is good. If it goes above three ounces, then it's four stamps. The things you learn. <laughs> kind of confusing, but figured it out. I do have to put these in the mail and find myself some food soon. Not sure where I'm gonna go. All right, I am going to leave now. I've been here for five hours, just making phone calls, packaging envelopes, um, sourcing mugs. He wants to buy some promotional items, so figuring that stuff out. I've also been calling people that have expressed interest in attending one of the travel shows. That's where Connor's at right now. He's traveling to these places to meet these people, and I'm responding to them and encouraging them to come. So. That is what I've been doing all day. I'm going to leave now, and I think I'm picking up Chipotle on the way home because I have chili at home, but I don't really want it. Chipotle just sounds better. <laughs> so we're gonna go get some. Yeah, I gotta put these in the mail too. Not too productive of a night. Um, I made some pasta for dinner. I think I'm going to edit a video quickly, get that out of the way, and then go to bed. It's kind of late, it's about 10, 15. I'm tired. I had a full day. I was, I worked this morning. It wasn't actually too bad. It was pretty easy. I'm doing it tomorrow, so I gotta get up at a decent time to get over there. Um, anyway, I'm going to sign out. So do what's right, and you will see me tomorrow.